My name is Victoria Rose and welcome to my channel. I do travel and adventure videos. I'm happy to have you here. Today's adventure is meeting my long lost sister in Germany. I am meeting up with my friend Rika and we've never met before. We're gonna try and go to the Tollwood Fest. I don't know what it is. It's some sort of German thing and it's been closed a long time because of Corona. So you have to be vaccinated or tested to be able to get into this festival. We're gonna go meet her for the first time and I'll show you the comparison because I feel like we look, not even just because we both have orange dreadlocks, but we actually like kind of look the same. Um, to come on a day in my life, I'm gonna say, show you some more German things if you're interested, because I'm learning just as you are. Also real quick, I wanna do a shout out to this brand, Etta Love. I'll put the link below for them, but I wanna show you what I got from them. They part with me for this video. So I'm just gonna show you a couple of things. I like to wear rings these days, but the rings that I've been wearing like, will turn my, um, I, I get cheap rings, so they turn my fingers green, um, but these ones won't do that because they're nice, high quality rings. I got this one because Victoria Rose. I also have a rose in my finger and then I have another rose. And then I got this little um, skull heart one. Not, I don't typically wear like gothic type of jewelry, but I liked, I definitely like this rose. Very good quality, very comfortable. But yes, so shout out to Etta Love. Links below. Let's go meet Rika. She actually just texted me, so let's see where she's at. So this is my outfit of the day. I have a lot going on. Um, not on purpose, but I have to carry so many things with me at all times. I have to have my vlogging camera. I have to have my wallet with like money and uh, ID and phone and everything in there. I have to carry my mask with me. And then I carry my book bag with my other camera. Right. It's a hot day today. Right. Oh wait, did you say I could vlog or not vlog? It's okay. Okay. But I'm not that videogenic. Videogenic, okay. Whatever. No, I'm not either. Okay, so I found Rika and she's beautiful. <laughs> and we're looking for a German beverage. What's it called again? Spitzi. Spitzi. <laughs> so then we're going to, she has to get a test to be able to get into the festival. And then we're going to go there. So that's free? Um, no, it was I think 89 cents or something like oh, that. Oh, that's not too bad. 89 cents. So we finally made it here and we are, we're next to the, what is it, Olympia Stadium you said? Yeah, so we're gonna take pictures <laughs> first um, for Instagram and then we're gonna go into Tollwood and see what's going on over there. So before we do this, we're gonna try Spetsy. And I, um, is this some sort of like soft drink? Like a pop soda? Yes, yeah, some sort of soft drink, like a fizzy drink. Mm -hmm. yeah. Fizzy, fizzy. Uh, yeah, fizz. like a, yeah, like a, what is that word? <laughs> uh, I know what you mean. <laughs> yeah. You can't close it again, so. Let's drink it off. One time again. Look at that. <laughs> okay. It tastes like orange. Uh, seltzer orange, seltzer, seltzer orange juice. All right, so we're gonna try and take some pictures in front of that. It's a beautiful day today, by the way. Today. She says really ugly today. Yeah. It's like a horrible day today. I can't stand it. Germans and their negativity, I tell you. <laughs> yeah. You guys are like that. Though. Definitely. <laughs> Americans are a lot more positive. I feel like fake positive too. Oh, what a beautiful day! And then Germans will be like, yeah. nine. 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 <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Bye, nine. Mehr um die Ecke. Is that? Always those doffs. 
That's what he said? Yes. <laughs> and I was like, ah, I don't think we are gods. I don't think we look like gods. <laughs> so we can't get in because she, she got a test, but it wasn't it's it's not valid. It's not, uh, okay, so we're finally into this popping festival that took so long to get into. Now let me just show you around here. It's basically, this festival is like, I guess, an international food and arts festival. Yeah. Yes. So we have like lots of booths and stuff, and I think it's probably more lively at night. Yeah, it's really hot. Yeah. There are also concerts. Like usually when there's no corona, there are huge concerts at the public festival. Yeah. Okay, so I got a crepe call. This one. It's very fun. Mm, yummy though. <laughs> So I'm back in my hotel and it was a great day. It started pouring down rain right when I got home. So it was perfect timing. Yeah, that was the uh, Tollwood Festival and um, things are a bit different now because of co Corona and it affects everything. I'm so happy to be able to meet people in all different countries and connect with them and make friends. Update from Germany. Just want to enlighten you guys on some things. Um, first off, I try to go to the gym. I asked them if they did a day pass and they said they do and they're like 25 euros and I'm like what the fuck? I didn't say that but in my head and in my eyeballs I'm like <laughs> they're like we only take cash I'm like okay well do you know where an ATM is? and they're like I don't know you have to you have to look it up I'm like thank you I've never really had problems going to gyms in different countries this is the most expensive day pass I've ever in all of my travels and I've gone to gyms all over the world um, 25 euros is equivalent to like $30 for a one day and I'm like what's it for a month well actually I had to go find an ATM and the whole way I'm just like seething inside you know like my plans getting changed I'm like I can't do this I can't do this and I walked all the way back and then I'm like I just want to use the weights can I just use the weights she's like no it's 25 for the day She's like, do you have the, the uh, whatever, what is it called, the proper mask? Like here, for COVID update, for you guys that don't know, um, this is also the first country that requires a certain type of mask, very specifically this kind. I started putting it on and I'm like, I can't pay that much. I'm going to go. She's like, I understand. She even understood how expensive that was because she showed me the pricing and you could get, if you paid for a year, you could get it for like $50 per month. Um, this is the most uncomfortable mask. I can't even wear it for short periods of time, so fuck that. I'm gonna do a hotel workout. So I got some coffee. Actually, the, the walk there was so beautiful, so it was worth it. I'm PMSing today, so I don't have the patience for anything. My $5 small. It's a beautiful city though, so pretty. That's my woe for the day. I know, the adventure's crazy. It's crazy. So I always carry this with me. You can usually find things around to work out with. Wait, 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 where are you? Maybe I should just lift this chair. I just wanna lift things! Oh, it's actually, it's a good, it's a good weight. Watch me break everything. So I could, I could do some squats with this, and it's pretty comfortable actually, like look at that. Oh, fuck. Yeah, oh boy, yes. Yes, okay. Guys, look, you don't need a gym. Oh yeah, we can definitely, oh. This is a hotel and a gym combined in one. It's really special. I put your band on like this, and I like to do hip thrusts. So. Oh, oh, we're breaking the chair. Oh, wait a second. <laughs> I don't think that works. Oh yeah, I love pressing those oh, spilled ovaries. Oh, this works. Oh, perfect. <laughs> that was so perfect, guys. <laughs> this isn't my proudest moment, but I gotta get the case. <laughs>
weather here because it's it's so much different than what I'm what I've been used to. Very UK like. Very rainy. I'm feeling like death today. Hello, Mother Nature. <laughs> Traveling and that together is exhausting. I don't know what I'm doing. What do you guys think I know what I'm doing? Do you think I, do you think I, do you think I know why I'm here, where I'm at? I don't know. <laughs> I do actually, I'm really happy though because I think Germany is really cool. And I wanna try and go to Berlin if I can afford it. Anyways, I'm just, I'm lonely. <laughs> find my friend that I've never met before and it's really difficult. Uh, this background music's fitting. It's really beautiful out right now. Look at this. Look at that. <laughs> so the shot Jägermeister. Yeah, we have to get that because that's German, right? Actually, I think it was oh, on the licorice. list. Yeah, black mm. licorice. Yeah, maybe. No, for sure. I think it was on the list of the worst alcohols in the world. Licorice. How do you feel? Oh. It's alright. <laughs> it's actually... I've never had that before. Yeah, and it tastes exactly like black licorice. <laughs> I'm so drunk. <laughs> I'm not, I just can't talk. Um, so it tastes exactly like black licorice, a Jägermeister. And it's made out of... 56 herbs and spices 56 and plants. Herbs and spices and plants. So I'm very, I feel very cultured and very German right now. Yeah. I don't know if other Germans really like this. Yeah. But it's, they do? Okay. We're, we're German. She's German. I'm becoming German. Mm -hmm. Myself. That's not good. No, it's that's just very wrong. good. That's my good? Ooh. So is this a palace or a castle? I guess it's a... It's more like a castle. It's a palace, I'd say. No, definitely a palace. Yeah, it a castle? Actually, it's called a palace because I saw the name on it. It's not yeah. a castle. It there's, a castle. there's no like castle things. It is a castle. I don't know.